So this is the Da Vinci S um, forearm robot. Uh, what we have here is four arms. Arms one, two, and three have equipment in them. And uh, the other arm here uh, is held for the camera that looks inside the body. So this arm is controlled um, in a console in the corner by the surgeon's right hand, the surgeon's left hand, and then you can actually click a clutch button and switch back and forth between these two arms with your left hand. So typically what we do is with this hand, we pull something aside, we hold something out of the way, and then with this hand, we actually do work. So to show you an example of some of the instruments, this is a scissor here. So we do this for, use this for a dissection. So it's this tiny little thing, um, but inside the console it looks huge because of the magnification. Um, this one here is called a suture cut needle driver. So this one um, we use to drive sutures and there's also a little scissor inside there to cut sutures. Um, and this one is called a prograsp and we use this to hold tissue. Um, hold tissue out of the way, hold it aside, hold it with, for dissection. And then the arms um, have so many dimensions of movement. We can move them like this. We've essentially got what we call sort of like a shoulder and then an elbow. Um, the arms move like this. They move um, side to side like this. That's another advantage of robotic surgery. With um, laparoscopic or keyhole surgery, you hold instruments like this, but your dimensions of movement are in and out. You can twist your wrist and you can open and close the instrument. With the robot, you actually have a wrist. This motion here, wristed motion. And in fact, the wrist. Show me that again. Sure. Wristed motion like this. Okay? Like a, mm -hmm. a wrist. Okay? You can't do that with laparoscopic surgery. And in fact, the Da Vinci wrist is superhuman um, or super physiologic. The Da Vinci wrist can go, I think it's 720 degrees where a human wrist maxes out like this, but the Da Vinci wrist can get like more than twice that when you're inside the, uh, inside the console. So that just sort of makes you a superhuman surgeon. <laughs> um, so that's, um, that's how surgery works um, with uh, Da Vinci Robotics. The patient is on the um, bed. Um, we get them all positioned, how, you know, whatever's necessary for that particular surgery. Um, we bring the robot in. Um, ports go into the stomach um, and then through that uh, we have the instruments um, that are connected to the da Vinci arm um, and then once everything is sort of clicked in place um, or what we refer to as docking the robot then the surgeon sits in the console in the corner um, where they have uh, little controllers and a bunch of foot pedals and they control the robot um, from inside the console. So this is the console for the da Vinci S. This is where the surgeon sits. Um, come on back here and I'll show you all the buttons. Um, so the head goes in here um, and once you're inside you get your uh, 3D vision and it senses that your head's in here so it won't turn on unless your head's in there. And then down here um, is, are the controls. So this is how um, the surgeon um, controls the robot. Okay. Down here with the foot pedals, um, there's a clutch um, which switches the uh, left hand to control the third or fourth arm. There's a camera pedal so you can uh, use, use the um, arms to uh, zoom in on a, whatever you're looking at. There's uh, two different types of electricity, bipolar electricity and monopolar electricity to seal over blood vessels. This button here does the focus of the camera. And then here, um, there's a number of um, choices to set the robot up exactly how you want it. 3D vision, the angle of the camera, um, the um, amount of uh, motion um, uh, precision that you have, the amount of working distance, um, and then a, a couple of uh, you know power button and emergency stop and things like that. Um, so when I put my head in here, and move these um, little joysticks around, that's, uh, that's how the operation is completed. So it's kind of like sitting in a giant video game. And that's the Da Vinci Robot. And I'm Dr. Jennifer Young with the Urology Group and Inova Loudon Hospital.